When I'm done with this soft white rapper, he'll be on lines after typing All Lives Matter. Ha <laughs> ha, white people. All right, Joseph, there's a movie. It's very bold, it's very risky. What were you hoping to convey with this? I want to do a simulation of what life is like in 2018. It is a experience of walking on eggshells mm. where uh, you have to be very careful what you say. Joseph Kahn is perhaps best known for directing some of the biggest music videos in the world. Say my name, say my name. I'm here running high. including several of Taylor Swift's. Oh. And he tells E.T. his new movie, Bodied, was actually inspired by one video in particular. I heard that Body is based off of the Wildest Dreams music video. Can you explain that? What ended up happening was that we had a little bit of controversy. You know, whenever I do any video for Taylor, the, uh, the, the media industrial complex <laughs> loves to create any sort of controversy because it's good for business. It's something to talk about, something to spread out, something to put a little, little hit piece out there and, and we all get to like chatter and, you know, get our hits and stuff like that. Yeah. So that week, you know, okay. that week it was, the, it was a little controversy about uh, about the nature of how I made that particular video and the location that I had, right? Mm -hmm. So I, you know, she of course is silent about this. She never speaks about any of the stuff. Me, I'm a little bit more rebellious. So I, I fought back a little bit. I justified it because I felt like there were some uh, accusations that were not correct, you know? Mm -hmm. And no matter what I said, uh, everyone was started calling me names. That sort of feeling of, of being attacked for something you said was the progenesis of Bodied. Does she know that? Yeah, a little bit. I think I, think I, told, I told her about the movie that I was making. When that happened, do you have to have that conversation with her? Uh, I think she, she handles it beautifully. Um, she is so much more mature than me. <laughs> what is the hardest shot that you've ever had to set up or that you've accomplished on a music video? The hardest shot that I've ever done no one has ever asked me that in 30 years. We did a Wildest Dreams video for Taylor Swift where uh, I was shooting in New Zealand mm -hmm. and I had two helicopters fly me and Taylor around to the top of a mountain uh, where she had to walk barefoot. On the mountain? On the mountain, yeah. So that's probably my hardest shot. I guarantee you we've, we've had human beings walk on mountains that no one had ever walked on before. Were her feet, I mean, did they hurt? Yeah. 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 Has she ever, was that an injury? Like, has she ever been injured? Not on my set, no. no. I, 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 I'm thankfully, no, I, I'm safety first. <laughs> but she cares about the art so much that she was willing to sacrifice her. Oh yeah, she's, her, feet. she's her body. Oh, she's, when she does a video, she's 100% committed. It's, it's really phenomenal to watch. I think that's why she's so successful because she's willing to completely, one, take the music video seriously mm. and put all the effort she can into it. When um, It's surprising when, when you work with her. Um, she's not like a big superstar, um, like sort of making you wait on her nails. She's just sitting on a chair, like patiently waiting for you to set up the shot. Like literally just a chair yeah. waiting. So it's incredible to see. Look what you made me do. Look what you made me do. I wish that Reputation was a visual album. Was that ever a conversation? Uh, no. No? <laughs> no. Are there more music videos coming? Um, I, I don't know. You really don't know? I don't know. Are you ready for it? When we see those hidden messages in her music videos, whose idea is that? Is uh, that a collaboration? It's usually collaboration, but when it really comes down to some of the deeper messages, those are all Taylor. And then when we saw all the, in the Look What You Made Me Do video, all the different Taylors, was there ever a conversation to have that play out more through the Reputation videos? Or was that just for that one video? That was just for that one particular video. And and uh, I think it was like, I think the entire thing came from a discussion because we were trying to figure out how to end the video. Because mm -hmm. um, we had this very big elaborate video, as you saw. Yeah. But we just couldn't figure out an ending. And then we suddenly decided, you know what? It would be cool if all the tailors talked to each other. Mm -hmm. and. Um, and that was it, really. 
Oh, there she goes, playing the victim again. If there was a song on Reputation that you could do a music video for that has not been released as a single, what would it be? I think I've made the videos that I've wanted to make for Reputation. Come on, <laughs> come on, give me one. Uh, I think, I think, uh, I, I never ever talk about the songs that uh, I haven't done. I only talk about the songs I have done.